In this video I am going to explain to you in details how you can easily format your pages using InstaBuilder built-in styling system. With InstaBuilder you don't need to learn HTML or CSS coding, all you have to do here is just point and click. Let's get started. InstaBuilder's typography control. I am going to show you how to change the font style of your content. Select the content you wish to edit or change, then at the font family above, select the font you wish to use. You can also change the font size, just choose from the font size drop down menu which size you want to use. You will see that the selected contents font face and font size has been changed. If you want to add a subline, you can also do that easily. Type your subline at the paragraph option above. Then let's change the font face and size. It's that quick and easy to do. Let's see the preview of the changes to our InstaBuilder page. All the changes we did are exactly shown in our InstaBuilder page. What you see is what you get. I will explain to you point and click CSS styling. You don't need to learn CSS codings to add some fancy style to your content. It's all point and click with InstaBuilder. Let's try adding more styles to our sample content. I will begin with drop caps. Let's select the first letter of our first paragraph. At the style options I will choose drop caps red. You see that the first letter of our paragraph has been turned into a drop caps in red. I will change another one and see what happens. The next style I am going to show you is the text highlight. I am going to select some text in our content and then from the style option above, I will choose the option text highlight in blue. See what happens. Let's do it again, different color this time and again in different color also. Let's preview the changes I made and the results are The page displayed the way I have edited them I will show you how to add boxes into your content I will put the cursor in a blank space then at the style option above I will choose simple box green. Let's try adding content inside our box. If you want to add title inside the box, just type your title there first, select it then at the style option. Choose box title, I will choose box title green for this sample. See now you have a title inside your box. You can add as many boxes as you want. You can even add boxes with rounded corner. Just choose rounded box in the style option above.
I am going to show you how to add bullet points into the content. Type the content that needs to be bulleted, then select them all. Click the bullet button above, you now have a bulleted list, we're not done yet, with the content still selected, at the style drop down menu, choose the style you want for the bullet list, here I will choose checklist number 1, see how it looks like now, let's select the list again, then choose another style from the list. Next on this video, I will show you how to use InstaBuilder's pre-made graphics. At the top of the edit page, you will find InstaBuilder icon. Click that icon to add our graphics to your content. Select the graphic you want to add from the drop-down menu. You can add as many graphics as you want. With InstaBuilder, we have many to choose from. Let's add another one. With InstaBuilder, everything is made easy for you. Just point and click. Don't forget to always save your changes. 